I believe that uh, to change society, it had to start with a proper education. And you know, in the Siem Reap city, English language is a mass uh, learning skill that younger generation can use to talk to a lot of foreigners. So learning English is one small part of uh, perception of learning to change society. YMCA volunteers actually interacted with the BBLC students where annually we send eight teams to BBLC to allow them to practice the English language and allow them to build up the confidence to be able to speak and use the language. We conduct like math, science, uh, arts and English lessons. Uh. Sometimes the children won't understand our lesson plans but we realise that it's not really the content of our lessons but more of our interaction with them that is more valuable to them. We visited BBLC in November 2015 and we conducted activities such as the repainting of an entire school block. We also helped organise games and activities so that the children may enjoy their time there. The most memorable experience for me was um Organising games and songs for the kids at BBLC. They really enjoyed it, even though it wasn't the best of the games. In BBLC, I saw that despite their harsh conditions, they still enjoyed their life to their fullest, and their enthusiasm for learning also helped to inspire me. BBLC is the best school for me. I learned a lot from BBLC, especially English. Now I can speak English better. I learned a lot from BBLC. I learned to be confident and I also learned to help my community. Before, I'm not a good student. I had to be a gangster or big brother in school. When I was studied in BBLC, I learned too many things in here. In uh, leadership, to be a good person in the social and community. The students, they have changed a lot. They will learn how to respect their parents or the people around them and they learn how to forgive and humble and patient and I can say that they have more love in their heart. By introducing education to this village, we allow the children to have a chance to be educated, to be developed. We believe that uh, this is one significant contribution we can make to develop this region you see, by investing in the young people of this village. We want to partner with a worthy local partner in KCC Kamai Christian Centre uh, under the leadership of Dr. Rasak Kim was God sent. And this is where the chemistry, the relationship started more than 10 years ago. In the last uh, 10 years, BBLC not just come here to teach English, but they also have with the infrastructure. And so far we've done uh, more than, uh, I think about 15 projects and all these projects based on the uh, immediate needs uh, for the community. We built a small BB learning centre, a single building block uh, with just three, four classrooms as it is. In the earlier years when we went there, literally there was just one building. No running water, no running electricity. We couldn't even stay at the building. The whole field was really big, but it was full of potholes. It was not possible for kids to run there. They would have broken their legs. So the first thing we did there was, every boy, let's go and get some tools. We leveled uh, a fairly sized hill, and then we flattened all the potholes in BBRC. That gave us a ground where we can uh, play uh, matches and games with the, the boys and girls of uh, the, the village. In the early days, there were difficulties because there was no electricity. So we had to depend on the generator set. And the access to the BBLC was very difficult. It was only until YMCA teamed up with us to build the road, which is now much better. So we came in, we built roads, we built irrigation systems and uh, many other bridges so that uh, we will help people to move around. Indirectly, through the irrigation system, we also help them to raise their income level. ការជួយនេះគឺពិតជាជួយយ៉ាងពិតប្រកាសដល់សហគមន៍ហើយជួយដល់សហគមន៍មួយចំនួនមានចំនួនដល់ទៅ 3 
chitran đã là sốc phu ở tất tua vô chỉ tí tận chất Now we are blessing the people to a point that is no longer uh, require most of our service because of the education uh, quality improvement and also the people uh, quality. Eventually the centre should be uh, run by Choti Kamai. They need to take the lead and take ownership of their life. We saw an impact on the lives of uh, the Cambodians that we come in touch with. They saw Singaporeans come in and out throughout the year. But what they really got out of it was the friendship and the realisation that other people wanted to make their lives better, wanted to play a role in their lives. I would like to see more Cambodians uh, hear more about it. Without BBRC, I would never come to this far. To Cambodian society, women, they don't have a lot of opportunity, they don't have a lot of chance to come outside to learn. But since BBRC is near, it's around my house, so I can come here and I can learn a lot from here. Thank you for BBRC that helping me. It's a half of my life that I study in BBRC. With that, BBRC more improving and more of the foreign people that come from overseas come to help BBRC and come to help the youth in Cambodia also. I hope to see BBRC grow much more than this. Now they are growing, but I want to see they are grow more, even more students will come and more staff, more teacher to volunteer or doing God's work and even teaching English. Now BBLC reached a 10 year anniversary so I wish them uh, good luck and I also wish them that they will be able to produce more uh, teachers and we are happy to be a blessing to the community. I wish BBLC another fruitful 10 years and fruitful collaboration with the YMCA of Singapore so that we bring the standard of living in this community to greater heights. I don't think we should just stop at 10. I think we should just perpetuate every 10th year we'll have something more to celebrate. And that's something like we like to see. More blessings to more of the people, the children in this village.